Hey everyone, let's see if we can figure out multiple choice number 11. So it says a certain type of remote control car has a fully charged battery at the time of purchase. The distribution of running times of cars of this type before they require a recharging of the battery for the first time after its period of initial use is approximately normal with a mean of 80 minutes and a standard deviation of 2.5 minutes. All right, so let me just pause here. Some buzzwords that are popping up. I see approximately normal. Right, I see a mean of 80 and a standard deviation of 2.5. And it looks like this. my variable in this problem is run times. So my variable here is car run times on this battery before you got to charge it. And it looks like the units are minutes. And I just snicker a little because um, at least at the recording of this, I had considered buying uh, an electric vehicle, but the idea that it would only run for 80 minutes, uh, and I have no idea, oops, I just hit something. <laughs> um, I'm sure batteries are better by now, but 80 minutes doesn't sound too long. Okay, so at this point, I know my distribution is normal, and we've got 80 and then 2.5. So at this point, I know I have a normal distribution. If they talk about having a sample of like 40 cars, then I'd be on a sampling distribution. So let me see if the next thing says that. The shaded area in the figure below represents which of the following probabilities. So there is no sample in this case, so this is just gonna be a regular normal distribution question. So that's gonna be from chapter six. So this number down here would be 80. If I added a deviation to that, that will be what, 82.5. And again, these the variable down here is run times. All right, let me write car run times in minutes. All right, and then if I lost two standard deviations, so I would need to do 80 minus 2.5 minus another 2.5, that is what, that is 80 minus five, that is gonna be 75. So this number here on the left bound of that region is going to be 75 minutes. And just from the empirical rule, I, I'm gonna guess some of this area. This is about 34% from the empirical rule. This is about 34% and this is about 13.5%. So if I if I wind up getting asked a, a shading area question, right, 34 and 34 is 68. If I take 68 and I add 13.5 to it, I'm gonna be looking at what, about 81.5%. So I've shaded about, oops, that's supposed to be an approximation symbol, 81.5% of the data. Okay, or the area under that curve. So let's see, the shaded, I wanna go back to this question over here. So the shaded area in the figure below represents which of the following probabilities. All right, so it, it represents the probability that the car runs between 75 and 82.5 minutes. So let's see, the probability, let me read A, the probability that the run time of a randomly selected car of this type before it requires a recharging of the battery for the first time after its period of initial use is between 75 minutes. Oh, and right there, 82.5 minutes, that's it. And let me just check against the rest of them and see what we got. 75 is correct, 85 is not. 77.5 is not correct, 82.5 is. And then neither of these values are correct. So yeah, I, I just I always like to read the other options and make sure I feel my answer is correct. So there we are with